In September 1963, Oswald is supposed to have traveled by bus to Mexico City. After the assassination, the Warren Commission asked the CIA for anything they had on Oswald. What the staff received from the CIA was this photograph of a man the agency tentatively identified as Lee Oswald going into the Cuban embassy. It obviously is not Oswald. Director Colby. During his visit to Mexico in September 1963, uh, you had Oswald under surveillance at both the Russian and Cuban embassies? No, no, no. We did not have him under surveillance. We became aware of a contact he made with each of those embassies. Did you make voice recordings of him? I, uh, I think there were, yes. Why was the Warren Commission given a photograph of a, a, another man at the Cuban embassy, wrongly identified as Lee Harvey Oswald? Well, it wasn't wrongly identified as Lee Harvey Oswald. Uh, we knew that he was in these embassies at a certain day. And we looked at the capability we had to photograph certain things in, that, in the city. And we looked at through the photographs, hoping that we could find perhaps a photograph of him as he came in or went out of uh, one of these embassies. We did focus on one uh, which we thought might be him. And this was flown up to Dallas, uh, labeled an unidentified white male. Uh, that's, uh, that was the identification of it. Uh, but it was flown up in case it could be helpful at that time. But there was not a photograph wrongly labeled. It turned out not to be Mr. Oswald, uh, clearly. Uh, and we, to this day, don't know who he is. Who, critics ask, is this man? Is he a CIA agent posing as Oswald? Where is the photograph of Oswald? David Phillips, who was with the CIA in Mexico City then and is now retired from the agency. Why did you watch Americans going in and out of the Soviet and Cuban missions? We didn't watch Americans going in and out. We watched uh, these missions on our radar screen, and every once in a while there would be a blip, and the blip would turn out to be an American. You know he was at the Cuban embassy. I do. No doubt in your mind about There's that. There's no question in my mind. You believe he was at the Soviet embassy. I'm not sure about that. I'm, I'm, I'm positive that he made contact with them. They all thought he was so strange that they didn't want to have anything to do with him, and they rebuffed him and told him that they were not interested. How certain are you of this? I'm positive. I know there are a lot of stories about photographs of Lee Harvey Oswald taken in Mexico. None were taken. There were no photographs of Lee Harvey Oswald. What about the accusation, it's made flatly sometimes, that the pictures of Oswald were destroyed? Absolutely untrue. I was there, and I know.